Yo, what's up guys? My name's Hacky and welcome to the three easiest movie inspired cars to make in GTA 5 online. I guess both movie and TV inspired. I find it a lot of fun to recreate these cars and make GTA 5 versions of them. So definitely customize them with me so you have your own. And here's today's notification shout out up on the screen. If you want to win one too, make sure you got the bell on so you're one of the first to type hashtag Hacky Army in the comments. And just before we begin the video, if you go on to enjoy it, take a second to drop a like on it. That'd be awesome. Also, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and drop us up because you do not want to miss any more videos like these feel free to help us reach our big goal of a hundred thousand subs we're getting fairly close to it so if you do want to help us get there that would be much appreciated also don't forget to turn on the notification bell as well real quick if you're in need of any of these gta online services check out the top link of the description and don't forget to use discount code hacky for five percent off at checkout also stop by the new giveaway site for some awesome prizes like xbox series x's ps5s and much more anyway though let's get back into the video so first up we're going to be recreating lightning mcqueen from the movie cars with a banshee 900r if you don't have one yet just buy one real quick i don't think it costs that much and then go into benny's original motor works so we're gonna leave things like the armor which doesn't really change much anyway so let's go into bumpers and i got a picture of lightning mcqueen pulled up right next to me which i could go off of so it's definitely not gonna be this super over the top one i think we're just gonna have to go for the stock one this is the simplest one that kind of looks like his mouth on the bottom so that actually worked out pretty well we don't really need to change anything regarding the engine since it's not anything external we're gonna leave the exhaust the same and then for fenders i think we're gonna go for this like clean looking one because he definitely doesn't have any carbon on him and this one does look best now for the hood we're gonna leave this one actually so the smooth hood that does look best plus he doesn't have any crazy things on it anyway the horn doesn't really matter the interior doesn't really matter and for headlights i think we're actually just gonna do the xenon lights now for the livery so this is actually a big one so we're gonna go ahead and do the yellow flash livery this one's by far the best one and when we change the paint job to a red it's gonna look even better so select the yellow flash livery and now we got the the plates don't really matter and let's go into respray this is obviously like the biggest one or as important as the livery i'd say so you guys want to go into metallic and let's go ahead and do we're gonna go for torino red or blaze red i actually think we're gonna go for blaze red so equip that and then do the same for the secondary color let's see what it looks like with the yellow on it so that actually doesn't look too bad but it doesn't look as realistic so we're just gonna go for the basic all red paint job so go ahead and equip that the roof obviously leave it stock you don't want to have an open roof roof now for the skirts let's choose something a bit better so i think either one of these i think i'm gonna go for this one so the street skirts then for the spoiler the spoiler the thing is he only has like a little elevated spoiler so i think we're gonna have to leave it at stock it's got a little bit more of an elevated spoiler in the back but i don't really want to choose this one because i think the stock one is closer to the actual version so we're gonna go for the stock option now for the suspension i think i'm gonna go for the lowered suspension i don't want it to be too high i don't want it to be this low though now for the tailgate oh this actually Actually changes the back so we might be able to find something closer to the spoiler or like the little elevated tip in the back and i think maybe this one it's gonna be either this bolt-on option or just the stock option i think i'm gonna leave it at stock so we're not gonna be able to get much closer than this transmission doesn't really matter turbo doesn't really matter now for the wheels this is another big part of it so let's actually look in so we're gonna go into los santos customs now to get some street wheels on this and for some reason it wasn't an option in benny's so let's go into wheels and then there we go street wheels so i think i'm gonna choose one of these ones all right so after looking at every single one of them go ahead and choose the hot ring steely this is the closest thing to it and it actually doesn't look too bad but instead of ice white obviously we're gonna change the color to a red and specifically the blaze red so go ahead and equip that and now i think for the very final touch it's got some white branding on it so let's choose one of these and this is the reason i wanted to put street wheels on it so we can put the branding on it as well i guess if you want you can add red tire smoke which i'm gonna do that but besides that this is lightning mcqueen this is basically as close as you could get to it in gta 5 online let me know what you guys think of this one it's not super accurate but it is definitely pretty similar some people have modded versions of this and you could definitely tell what they were going for now let's move on to the next one next one's gonna be the scooby-doo van it might be called the mystery machine i'm not too sure but for this one we're gonna use the yuga classic you can get in the benny's website so let's go ahead and drive it into benny's i think it's mainly like an aqua blue and a green theme but let's go ahead and check it out so it doesn't have a chassis let's see about the exhaust so i don't think it has this side exhaust either the headlights we're gonna leave the same and then the livery is a big one obviously so we're gonna go for the surfs up livery so number nine out of 13 this is pretty freaking accurate this gives it the whole scooby-doo theme honestly and let's check out the respray so the primary color is actually gonna change this okay and let's see about the secondary color so the secondary color changes the roof's color and then the primary is like the part under it i mean we're gonna have to match it up with the waves color anyway so let's search for like an aqua blue type color the mariner blue is a 
little bit too dark for it so hopefully we can find something better and i think this light blue is pretty much perfect yeah they're like almost identical so i'll go ahead and buy the light blue option and do the same for the secondary color as well so we're gonna search for light blue metallic is it just me or does it look lighter than the primary color is light blue i don't know why it looks a little bit different it may just be the lighting but it looks a little bit lighter than the primary color and i think they're exactly the same yeah light blue i don't know why that is but it might just be the lighting but it still does look pretty cool now let's go ahead and continue so for the roof let's see we got the sunshade does it have a sunshade i'm not too sure all right so i just checked and there's no sunshade which is good now for the skirts let's see so we got this stock option and then this one the body of the car isn't really close to the wheels themselves plus it has like a fairly big bumper on the front which it doesn't have either so we're gonna leave it at that and then for suspension let's see well this is definitely way too low so i think we're gonna leave it at stock as well and then for the tailgate well it doesn't have that extra wheel so we don't need that either and then finally for the wheels this is a big part of it obviously whichever one we end up choosing we're gonna actually make it orange because there's some orange on the vehicle all right so i looked through a bunch of wheels and i think we're gonna go for this one the a's real and then we're gonna go into wheel color and we're gonna go ahead and make it orange this bright orange is too bright so it's either gonna be sunrise orange or just regular orange and i think we're gonna go for regular orange so let's go ahead and equip that and the thing is some of the images i saw had branding on the wheels some didn't so i think i'm gonna leave it without branding and for the window we definitely don't want to put too much tint on it i think i'm just gonna do light smoke just to customize one more thing on it and i think we're done we are officially scooby-doo approved but i think that's as close as we're gonna get it's not perfect with the paint job but i wish there was more of like an aqua type blue on the paint job this is the closest option i could find honestly now for the final vehicle we're gonna be recreating the batmobile now obviously we're gonna be using the vigilante for this and yes i'm about to spend 3.75 million dollars for this so there we go we got a new vigilante we just bought all right so here it is and we actually have to customize it in the back of the moc so sadly you do need a vehicle workshop in the back of your moc to customize this but there isn't too much we could do i mean we could put some xenon lights on it we obviously want it to be a matte black or like a metallic black probably a matte black to be honest so we're gonna keep it at that suspension we're gonna put it at race suspension and it doesn't look like we could do much to the wheels either so there isn't a whole lot of things we can of course tint the windows though we're definitely gonna put some limo tint on the windows right there and that's about it so not much to customize there but it already comes to fall as like a very batmobile looking vehicle it does look really sick the boost is sick it's super strong as you guys just saw but i hope you all did go on to enjoy this video let me know if you guys want to see more awesome like movie slash tv inspired vehicles i'd be happy to make more of these but make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe if you guys are new turn on the notification bell as well anyway though this has been hacky have a good rest of your day i'll see you guys in the next video and peace